When a recent video of Adriano, the former Brazil striker, went viral, fans were concerned. The video showed him barefoot in the street, drinking beer and looking quite different from his football days. Adriano, who retired in 2016 at just 34, had an impressive career with 14 major trophies, including four Serie A titles with Inter Milan. However, despite his success, Adriano never fully lived up to the high expectations many had for him. Debuting for Brazil at only 18, he was once seen as the heir to Ronaldo, but his life took a challenging turn following the passing of his father. Grieving and struggling with depression and alcoholism, Adriano found it difficult to stay on track during his time in Italy. Some fans, though, were quick to defend him, arguing that he was simply enjoying a casual moment with friends and no longer struggling with addiction. Adriano isn't the only Brazilian football icon whose life has been touched by controversy. Here are some others. Robinho. Robinho, another former star, faced serious legal troubles after his career. The ex-Real Madrid and Manchester City forward was sentenced to nine years in prison for involvement in a group sexual assault incident from 2013. While he tried to appeal the conviction, his final appeal was dismissed by Italy's Supreme Court in 2022. Initially sentenced in Italy, Robin Ho's extradition didn't go through, so Brazil ruled he would serve his time in his home country. Despite his appeals, Robin Ho has been unable to overturn the conviction. Danny Olvas In early 2023, former Brazilian defender Danny Olvas was released on bail after serving time for rape accusations dating to December 2022. The accusations stem from an incident in a nightclub in Barcelona, where Olvas was later convicted. Olves, one of the most celebrated defenders in football, always maintained that the encounter was consensual. After his arrest, his wife initially filed for divorce but later paused the proceedings. Olves, now on provisional release, must appear in court weekly as he awaits the final verdict on his case. Ronaldinho, the legendary Ronaldinho, also encountered legal troubles post-retirement. In 2020, he and his brother were detained in Paraguay after using falsified passports to enter the country. The two were arrested and held in a maximum security prison, where Ronaldinho famously played in a prison futsal tournament. His team won the final 11, minus two, with Ronaldinho scoring five goals and assisting on the others. After spending a month in jail, he was allowed to move to house arrest at a nearby hotel amid COVID restrictions. Eventually, the brothers were fined and they returned to Brazil. Edmundo, known as the animal for his intense style. Edmundo's off-field life was equally dramatic. In 1999, he threw a circus-themed party for his son's birthday, which included feeding alcohol to a chimp dressed in a track suit. That same year, Edmundo faced legal troubles after causing a fatal car accident while allegedly driving under the influence during Rio Carnival. Though he was convicted of culpable homicide, his sentence was reduced significantly on appeal. Hulk. Lastly, former striker Hulk made headlines for his personal life. After a 12-year marriage to Iran Angelo, Hulk surprised many when he announced he was in a relationship with Camila Angelo, his ex-wife's niece, just months after their divorce. Hulk defended the relationship, stating he had nothing to hide. And the couple has since welcomed a child together.